Oh boy, I'm getting beat up this season. Look at these ranks! Oh my god, Diamond 1, 3v3 standard. Eh, that's about where I was, but man, my solo standard is way down. Look at that, Platinum 2. For those who aren't in the know with Rocket League, basically that's that's three ranks below my my normal, which is... Fuck it. Whoa, what did I just do? Oh boy, calm down, Waymo. Which is <laughs> disheartening. Man, I played three games last night. They were all terrible. Terrible. I lost all of them. <laughs> it was bad. I swear to God, every other player on the other team was... Sorry, I'm messing with my headphones. Was a was a champion or... God, they're fucking doing crazy spin moves and backflips. And they're like riding on top of the ball doing kickflips over me. Made me look like a fool. And it was just... It was, it was something. I was very disheartened. <laughs> That's the right way to put that. I'll shut up. Let's get into the game. So yeah, happy springtime. It's getting, well, it's almost springtime, I guess. Not officially, but it is getting warmer-ish outside. If you, <laughs> if you live somewhere where it's perpetually cold, happy, uh, happy less snow, I suppose. Uh, somewhere like, I don't, I don't know, fucking the Arctic Circle or fucking Finland. Oh shit, I don't, oh my god, I don't know where Finland's at. Wait, isn't it the top part above? Oh, this is make, gonna make me sound like a fucking terrible person that doesn't know his geography. Isn't it? Damn it. Isn't it like above uh, above Europe, right? The little... <laughs> the hanging balls right there on the map. Oh, that was not a great hit, and that was not a great spin into the goal. Yep, that's... Yep, I gave that up to him. Yeah, it's a little the little hanging uh, testicles on the, uh, you know, the west side of uh, Russia, right? 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 No, maybe. I don't know. I it just... I'm, I'm asking you. I've got, I've got a Google thing here, maybe I can ask that. And it'll give me coordinates, which will be completely meaningless. <laughs> uh, if you're watching this in the future, uh, happy summer, happy happy fall, happy Thanksgiving, Christmas, Easter, whatever time of year it is. I hope you're having a good day, regardless. That was great. Oh, <laughs> good defense. Yeah, I don't know, I just, hey, good defense on me. There we go. I'm just in a good mood today. Just, uh, uh oh, having a good time, that's all. Excuse you. Just trying to win me some games because I am getting raffle stomped in this game lately. Like it is bad. It is that was a terrible shot. No, make it. Yes. No. Yes. Here we go. Was that good? Ho, ho, ho. I think my phone is ringing. Hold on. Wait. Yeah, my phone was ringing. What the fuck? Sorry. I realized I stepped away from the mic for a second there. Weird. Getting a phone call mid-recording. I think that's the first time that's happened. Hey, put it on the record books. Got a phone call during recording. That's that's fucking fantastic. One to one. We can win this game. We can win this. Don't go up the wall. Yes, 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 yes. Eh. Is that too far? It's too far. It's too far. Wemo, get in there. Oh, damn it. Almost though. Hey, good landing. Did you see that landing? That was tight as fuck, yo. Yeah. So it's uh, it's getting warmer out. You know the the plants are starting to bloom. I've got a bunch of hostas out in front of my house. What do you guys uh, what do you guys prefer for plants? What is your preferred house plant that you have? In your garden, or you know, maybe in your living room. What what do you guys have for plants? Because I've got fuck all. Mainly because I'm irresponsible, <laughs> and I I kill them. I used to have like an English English ivy plant, which I realize is like one of the most hardy house plants you can have. And uh, yeah, I uh, didn't water it as much as maybe I should have, and it died. And then I put it outside, and then I promptly forgot about it. <laughs> Guess what's growing outside my house right now? <laughs> A big ass ivy plant that I have yet to cut down because I just haven't. I guess I don't know. They're cool looking plants. Have you ever seen like I don't know if it's English ivy actually. I know it's some kind of ivy What kind specifically I guess I'm not entirely positive. What am I talking about right now? Uh, <clears throat> plants. Yeah, I don't know something to talk about. I suppose plants are cool. I just I wish I had more of like a uh, The ability to grow them proper or pay attention to how they're growing make that yes That's what I like to see because I would really like to have a few more plants like they make really cool like uh, almost like mini palm trees yeah, I think they're like fir bushes or some shit like that, but they're really cool looking. I want to I wanna get me one of them. Maybe I could get one of those and try and take care of it. I mean, what do you guys think about that? I'll, <laughs> I'll post a vlog on taking care of my one plant. <laughs> Fucking entertainment at its finest right there. That would be, uh, that would be something, wouldn't it? Oh, oh, that was almost a good cut by that guy. I don't know. I think, I think that could be entertaining. We can, we can measure. Oh, come on. No, we could, we could measure the stick growth. <laughs> How much it grows from week to week in a vlog. How fucking entertaining would that be? Giraffe don't. No. Here we go. Here we go. I don't know. I, I think, so. you know, a proper YouTuber, a good YouTuber should be able to make just about anything entertaining, regardless of context. Ugh. Damn, he played under me. They should be able to uh, make watching paint dry entertaining, right? That's that's their li literally, 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 literally their job. I'm not drunk. You're drunk. I don't know if I could do it though. I'm I'm not quite uh, skilled enough yet. 
Which uh, reminds me, I should add Mike Rowe on Twitter. You suppose Mike Rowe's on Twitter? Uh, the guy, I was talking about him in a daily a while ago. He's, he's really... God damn, all kinds of shit coming off my phone today. Really uh, prominent uh, uh, voice, I suppose. Voice actor. He does a lot of like narration and various other things, but he's really good at it. Super good. I mean, he's... I don't know. If you were to do a study on how to be proper and and uh, correct in your voice acting career, he would be a great case study to uh, follow because it's just... He's astonishingly good at it. And classically trained, too. I mean, it's amazing. Oh! So, yeah. I should follow him on Twitter. See if he's got anything good to say. I'm sure he does. Apparently he has a presence on uh, on the YouTubes. Maybe I'll uh, I'll take a look at that. See if he's uh, doing anything interesting. Not that he would respond to a small YouTuber like me. That'd be... That would be fucking cool, but no, I, I kind of doubt it. Apparently he goes to, like, uh, cafes. Where does he live? Like, oh, fuck, Santa... F no, I want to say Santa Fe, but that's not right, obviously. Uh, San Francisco? Is that right? Maybe. I'm not entirely sure. Wherever he lives, apparently he goes to, like, the bars and everything, and, you know, like any normal person would, and talks to people, and... Very nice guy. This is just what I'm told. This is hearsay, but... I don't know. I'd like to meet him. I think that would be... It's on my bucket list. It's on my, uh, list of things to do before I die. And, you know... You never know, maybe this stuff takes off and I get big and then I could do that. That would be pretty awesome, actually. That would be like top list of things, or top of the list of things that I would want to do. I don't know, some people want to like go to E3 and shit. Nah, I just want to meet Mike Rowe. I think that'd be pretty awesome. You know, I'm not big on celebrities, you know, or celebrity faces or anything, but he's, he's a cool person. I think it'd be pretty awesome to talk to him about how he got started. Like, you don't, you see a lot of these people, they're pretty prolific, like in their, uh, in their careers after they've gotten started, you know, when everybody starts to know them, they're... The, you know, they've already established who they are. I think it'd be really cool to hear how some of those people got started. I mean, I'm sure there's all kinds of stuff on the internet you can find, like, uh, do research and stuff on these people and figure out what they did before they, uh, were, you know, whatever, hosts of shows or voice actors and, you know, I don't know. I think, uh, I think it'd be neat to hear. Everybody's got a story, right? And I'm sure his is no different than anybody else's. It's probably interesting in its own little right. That was a good first game. Got a win. I'm, I'm, I'm thoroughly impressed. Wow, look at that car to the left. Chronic thrusting. <laughs> Chronic thrusting, huh? That's, uh, that's pretty impressive. Chronic thrusting. Hmm. Did that bring me up a division? I don't know. Look at how many wins I have! I, I, I played more than three games last night, I think. I think I played like ten games, and I only got three wins out of it. That's, that's pretty sad. Oh, man. I'm, uh, my solo standard skills are lacking unless I'm blabbering on like an idiot about an unrelated topic. In which case I have no trouble. <laughs> what the fuck? It's, that's a clear sign of overthinking what you're doing, I think. Yeah, probably just, probably just me overthinking. Maybe getting a little heated under the collar. I think I was pretty upset, much to my friend's dismay last night. I think it was Joe Bear in here, actually. <laughs> I think he got mad at me yelling at the other team. <laughs> so he kind of bounced out early. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. Yeah, uh, if you guys watch my Left 4 Dead stuff, you'll know ooh, 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 you'll know who Joe Bar is. One of my old uh, friends that used to play Left 4 Dead with uh, back in the Dizzy. We still we still play games every now and again together. And, yeah, I think he was getting mad at me last night, but that's that's neither here nor there. Wow, both those people just missed that ball. All right, what? Well, yeah. Oh, I need a vacation from work, man. You got you guys. Oh fuck, am I the only one back? Oh good, it's not gonna make it. You guys ever get to that point where it's like, you know work is kind of starting to get to be a drag, and you're like, man, I need a vacation. It's like, I need to get out of there. What's, uh, what's your ideal vacation? Are you, are you the type to sit at home? Does anybody else do that? Because I really, really like just sitting at home. Just, just, I swear to God, I could just stare at the wall for, like, hours, and just have nothing to do. You know, it's, I'm, I'm not a great adult. Let's, oh, for fuck's sake. Let's just say that. Damn. Damn. <laughs> I, uh, I tend to do that quite a bit. Slack off, I suppose. Uh, maybe... What's what's the word for that? Procrastinate. Yeah. Much to my high school teacher's dismay back in the day. That was something I was very good at doing. That was supposed to be an airball. Is, uh... <laughs> waiting until the last minute to get my work done. Something actually I've been trying to work on here, doing the YouTube stuff. Uh, it, it, it's surprising how much, uh, work you generate for yourself just by, uh, just trying to upload simple videos. It, it actually, it surprised the shit out of me the first time I started doing it. Oh, you gonna make that? Yeah, boy! That's what I like to see. That's where it's at. So yeah, what, uh, what would you guys do if you were to go on vacation? Like, whatever, like a paid vacation, normal vacation from work, say, I don't know, like a week, right? And granted, your income would have something to do with what you say. Some people might go to fucking, I don't know, like Cabo or some shit during the summer, which would be awesome, but unrealistic for somebody like me. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, I'm happy with having the chance to go, oh fuck, to like, fucking, ah, whoa, oh, 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 oh. I'm happy with the chance to go to, like, Home Depot for 20 minutes. 
<laughs> and just be able to just sit there and damn, sit there and stare at the uh, the wicker furniture <laughs> and wonder what it would be like to have that specific chair on my deck. <laughs> That's I've done that before. I I'm sure that other people have too. That's not just me, right? Like you stare, at, I don't know, stupid shit like a, a grill or a pair of gardening shears you don't even need, and you're like, yeah. Yeah, I could totally start gardening. It, what? I'm not a gardener. You know what I mean? Stupid shit like that. I do that a lot, actually. A lot more than I probably should. Uh, dreaming of what it would be like to be... To do something different. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to hit him. That wasn't good. <clears throat> and, uh... Yeah, I, I, I enjoy that stuff. Just There's a... Uh, there's an interesting thing... Oh, boy. That wasn't a good hit. There's an interesting thing I read once that said... Uh, <clears throat> that... Uh, wow, sorry. What a thing! God, what the hell's wrong with me? That said, uh, shopping like that is actually good for you. It's uh, kind of like a... Uh, mm, it triggers the reward center of the brain more than maybe it should, like caffeine or, you know, illicit substances or nicotine, for instance. And, uh, yeah, apparently doing shopping online, like, not necessarily buying anything, but just looking at buying stuff serves the same effect. Like, it, it makes you happier to look at stuff that you want to buy. I, I, I don't know, I thought that was pretty interesting. I should look up that article, because it was a good, it was a good read, if I recall. Damn, I tried to, tried to sneak it around him. One of those odd little human quirks that you kinda, every now and again you get to know, right? Like, you realize this stuff, I think... It's one of those things that people know, but they don't necessarily uh, realize or even think about. Shower thoughts, if you will. The odd little huh moments that nobody else even cares about, and you try to talk about it at work, and everybody's like, what the fuck are you talking about? Damn it, I've blown up like four people this match and have not hit a single good ball. Also, I'm being extremely defensive. Maybe I should, uh, what do you think? Should we be a little more offensive? Let's, uh, let's stop talking about stupid shit. Oh, well, fuck. I was gonna say, let's stop talking about stupid shit and see if focusing on the game causes me to lose matches. Maybe... <laughs> Maybe we'll, we'll do that for the next match. We'll focus on the game. How about that? And we'll see if that actually makes me lose the round or not. Uh, I, I, have my, uh, I have my suspicions, but uh, we'll see. Rob, you going for that? You are. Cool. Doesn't matter. Eh, my boost. My boost, my boost, my boost, my boost. Eh. Eh, eh. Oh, yeah. Got the wall hit. I've been practicing that, actually. I did... Uh, oh, I probably did a solid hour of, uh, of wall hit practice the other night. I saw they released a good uh, training pack. If you follow anything about this game... Uh, there's there's various training scenarios you can do where it kind of sets up the ball in certain spots and you have to try and hit it or block it or shoot it or whatever whatever you would need to do and there was one released recently that was like uh, uh, wall hit training or wall hit aerials there oh, oh, oh anybody else there nope shoot that shoot that and, mm -mm. damn it and uh, so I, I spent like an hour the other night playing that wall hit training and it was a lot of fun I, I enjoy just kind of droning out you know turning up the music you know, whatever your favorite songs are, Christian Rock, or whatever it might be, Christian Bale. <laughs> and, uh, and droning out and just practicing, uh, like, uh, like you would when you're running. It's like that, I suppose, like a runner's high, without any of the physical exertion. Is that going to be a run-back goal? Nope, there's a guy back there. Damn it. Go up for that. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there, just noises. See, when I start talking about the game, it's just noises. And, uh, you know, that's, that's going to be how it is. Don't hit that, don't hit that, you son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Oh, 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 it's in. Look at that. So apparently, uh, you know, somewhat paying attention to the game doesn't hurt me all that much. Maybe I just need to divert some of my uh, overly active imagination to uh, something else, some other topic while I'm playing this game in order to stay uh, competitive, if you will, in my current class. I don't know. Just felt like last night there was a lot of bad players. And that's, I guess that's how, oh, fuck, that was bad. I guess that's how it always feels, right? It's easier to blame your teammates than it is to blame yourself, so... People will tend... That was a bad hit, Whamma. Oh, there's nobody there. People tend to blame their teammates over themselves, and... Turning that off, coincidentally, I'll talk about it in the beginning of the next game. Being able to, uh, to look at a game and... And view it objectively and say I objectively did bad or good is a very difficult thing to do. It, it's hard to not be subjective when it comes to... You know, playing video games or playing sports or doing really... A lot of things in life are kind of like that, you know. You have to be able to take a step back and be objective about stuff. And it, you really feel an advantage for doing that. But, <laughs> it is so much easier to just be subjective and say, Uh, no, that was somebody else's fault, not mine, because my hit was perfect, right? Played high. Yeah, you see that? Yeah, played like a bitch. No. Oh, I tried to ram him. Yeah. He, he, he. He, he, play it. Play it, fool, play it. Yeah. Oh, damn, I tried tried so hard. Yeah, we're gonna focus on this game now. We're gonna be objectively better or worse one way or the other. Look at that! 
Rebound! Oh my god, Twitch TV slash Dabo10. <laughs> Dob10? What, what does that actually say? I'm bad at reading names. Yeah, it's just Dob10. Maybe, maybe it's Dabio? Dabio! What's up, money? How you doing, boy? I, <laughs> I don't know. Is he gonna miss the kickoff? Had a few of those last night. People missing kickoffs at this level of play is pretty, uh... It, it's it, it, it's soul-wrenching. It's I don't understand how people miss kickoffs when they, you know... Reach the platinum level of play. I, I would call this like the mid-tier of play. Like you, you got that other boost. You don't need that one. The mid-tier play, like the play level where you've you've got an understanding of how the game is supposed to work. So you know, you're playing with other people who kind of get it, right? I don't know how. Shit, whammo. Got, get your hits together, man. Oh, oh, oh. Nah, I can't cut it. Can't make it there. My boost and blow him up. Perfect. That works for me. <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know. Weird. Ah, shit. Didn't get past. No, Rob. Rob, no. Oh, wow, we crossed the goal with that. That's kind of a bad idea, bud. Risky strategy. Let's see if it pays off for him, Cotton. <laughs> I, I watched... I watched fucking... Uh, oh, what the hell was it? Cars 3. I watched Cars 3 the other night. Yeah, a grown adult. I watched Cars 3 for no other reason than I was bored. Uh, I... It, mm, I cried, yeah. Who doesn't cry when they watch Cars? I mean, come on, it's an emotional movie. You know, that, that poor... Poor NASCAR. He, he just tried to get everything out of life that he wanted. Oh, fuck, that was terrible. He was just trying to get everything out of life that he can, and he just doesn't understand. He just wants to go fast, like Ricky Bobby. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, watching stupid movies like that, like, uh, what else did I watch? Baby Boss? I watched that a couple weeks ago, and that was... I mean, they're on Netflix. They're one of those things that's like, hey, it's on Netflix, I'm gonna watch it. That worked way better than it should have. Don't make that, Rob. Nope, none of that. I didn't mean to double jump on that, but that's alright. Ooh, good clear twitch. Can you double hit it? Not quite. Not quite. That's alright. Oh, they're being tricksy with their clears, aren't they? Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> Just slam into a car who missed the hit. That's fantastic. Uh, oh, but, 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 you got it, you got it. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hate when the balls hang in the spots where you're like, I'm not sure if I should push forward or be defensive about this. I almost always err on- wow, that worked out well. I almost always err in this game on the side of being extremely defensive, but I don't know. I think there's something to be said about pushing an offense out, you know, even under unideal, 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 under bad circumstances. Sometimes pushing an offense out from you know seemingly risky uh, positions is you know, advantageous. It, it can be, it can be played well, and you make some run back goals that way for sure. Uh, oh boy, that was not a great clear, but nobody's there. Hey, what the hell? This dude sitting up there on a boost pad for some reason. <laughs> That's that's not where you're supposed to be, buddy. You're supposed to be covering that clear. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That was a good uh, midfield little cherry pick there. I need to get up for this. There we Damn, Twitch TV. You playing like a boss. You're going Spider-Man and shit. That's, uh, where's Mary Jane, huh? Get her in here to give you a kiss or something for that. Is that, is that going all the way? No. Surely not. Right? Nope. And nobody's back. Shit. Fucking hell. Watch them rebound hits, guys. I'm getting these little bitch boosts because I can't seem to pick up 100 to save my life. Uh, you're gonna hit that again, Rob? Yes, you are. Eh. Bounce that off the wall, hopefully. There we go. I was... Uh, ideally, that would win in the goal, but, you know. Shit. It's supposed to be a fast aerial. It didn't work out. Twitch, get back for it! Get back for it! What are you doing? Get the ball! Oh my god, I thought he was gonna spin for boost. That would have been a bad call. Uh, uh, uh... Well, Alright, that's fine. Oh, that's even more fine. Is that going in? Boom, baby! The long-range bomb. That's about as far as you can get with that ball, wasn't it? He hit it right off the bounce, so it had that extra speed to it. Man, I love those. Beautiful. 97 kilometers an hour. That's, uh, it's pretty quick. It's pretty quick, considering it covered the entire map. And there's the forfeit. Guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I know it was random. Eh, we're just having a little chit-chat, right? I just had to, eh, whatever, having a little talk. Uh, let me know what you think down in the comments below. Eh, talk to me. I'll talk to you. You know how it works. My link for Twitter is down in the description as well. Feel free to hit me up on that anytime. And I will see you guys in the next video.